This episode of Techzilla is brought to you by Domain.com. Hey, you, did you know that you can access other computers or allow another user to access your computer securely over the internet? Um, there's a lot of software out there that right. lets you do that relatively easily, but Chrome Remote Desktop is out of beta after a mere year of development, <laughs> and you've been puttering around with it, have you not? I think you've, you've actually probably spent more time with it than I have. It, yeah. It's kind of funny, right? If you, if you go to Chrome's blog spot, it's basically like controlling your computer from afar. This time it's built into the browser, which is so bizarre. Uh, Chrome, it, it's a browser, it's a, de it's a remote it's access awesome. tool. It's awesome. Yeah, so it's an extension that you download yeah. from the from the Chrome App Store, and I've installed it on uh, both of my machines, so I've got my PC at home and, and also my Air. And in case it's not abundantly clear, this is not Chrome operating system specific. This no. is like OS X and Windows yeah. and Chrome and who knows what all this else. This is just as long as you've got Chrome running, you're in good shape. Right. Um, so you can do a couple the of browser. different things. The browser, yes. <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't even know how to specify that, I guess. All right. If you've got the Chrome browser running, you'll be in good shape. Um, so it can do two things. It can do remote access assistance, mm -hmm. so you can actually give tech support to people who are in need, or you can actually uh, go back and forth between your own computer. So if you have a computer at home, all you need to do is set up an admin password on both machines and you can just log into that remotely with that password. Cool. Um, so if I want to take a look at my PC at home, I just click on it, enter in my key, and then hopefully my PC is still on at home. It is! Yay! So you can see uh, that my Windows 8 machine, I just installed Windows 8 last night actually, nice. um, is running nicely like that. You can, you can do things on the desktop, like you can see the weather, the local weather. Um, I don't know what the equivalent of the start key is on my on my. Uh, try the command key. Let's try the command key and see if that brings up start. Yes, command Woo! key. So <laughs> figuring out little things like that might get a bit tricky. Um, but then if you want to log into someone else's computer, uh, they just have to make sure they also have the extension, the Chrome Remote Desktop, up and running on their machine. Nice. And then they'll get an access code. And then you plug that in on your end of the, of the internet. And you can jump on their machine, give them any tech support they need, You know, start running apps. Uh, it's, it's really, really convenient. And it's totally free. And so far, it's been working wonderfully. Uh, the thing that that really cracked me up this morning, though. I was um, I was playing around with it, and I accidentally hit my MacBook Air. And this is what happens: you get computerception. <laughs> <laughs> into infinity. I was like, why is this happening? What did I do? And I was like, oh, I logged into my own machine using remote desktop. And apparently, that's what you get. It's just one giant recursive snake swallowing tail thing. Yeah. Yeah. I can see. I can see forever. The tabs are so beautiful. <laughs> we got more of your emails still to come while Veronica untangles whatever we're going to call that. The wormhole I just created. Right now it's time to take a moment to thank one of our sponsors. <laughs> When you register a new domain name, make sure it's a .com. A .com is the instantly recognizable domain name that gives your website credibility no matter what name you choose. And the best place to get a new .com domain is at domain.com. They're affordable, reliable, and easy to use. Plus, domain.com's active social media presence on Twitter, at domain.com, and some great customer support make it a great place to do business. We have an awesome coupon code for you, 20% off Domain.com's already low prices. All you need to do is use the coupon code TECHZILLA when you check out at Domain.com and you're going to save money. 20% off folks, big time savings. Give the TechZilla coupon code some love and when you think domain names, think Domain.com. And did you notice that's a .com?